the weapons. Collective Edge. Welcome to the Weapons Collective Edge. Well, we're going to go on our round six of our sword workout. And today is going to be all about breath control. So what I mean by breath control is we are going to, the first exercise we're going to do is called three, two, five. We're going to breathe in three breaths in a three uh, seconds. So one, two, three, hold it two, and then do five cuts, which will be breathing out. So go. So basically trying to breathe in for three seconds, fill your belly and your lungs and your chest. Hold it for two seconds while we're up, and then five seconds would be, you know, five cuts to make the five seconds. So, but everything we're gonna try to do in this particular series, in this episode, is gonna be all about your breath control. So my cuts and everything that I'm doing, and everything fancy, if there's anything fancy, is not really what the point is. The point is control that breath, to control how your breath is moving through your body so that you can expand your lungs better it'll create maybe a little more endurance hopefully lung capacity stuff like that so that's what we're shooting for okay so in this one we're going to use some weights and an exercise band if you don't have an exercise band see if you can get yourself one because in this case you kind of need that tension but if you don't have it you can still do these exercises with an extra twist further, because that's what this is gonna apply. And weight wise, I got 10 pounders. Um, we're gonna be doing lateral raises, so I wouldn't go over like 20, 25, unless you're you know, really buff. But uh, something you can raise and hold it there for a sec. So that's what we got, see if you get those. So let's get our interval timer started and uh, we'll get going. Here we go. First one, like I said, is three, two, five. Hold for two and two, th five cuts. One, and breathe in. Hold for two and then breathe out your mouth. And up. Hold. that series another time and we're I'm not gonna count it all out. Just gonna go through it through the breathing. Okay, we're here. Okay. Okay. Next one we're gonna do is three in, three out.
Okay, next one. You act to thrust. With breathing in, breathing out. In. Into the nose, out to the mouth. If your nose is completely plugged up, I'm doing pretty good today, but if it is, you can breathe in and out of your mouth. But normally it's in through your nose, out through your mouth. We're going to use our band now. Put your band underneath your foot. Hold on to it. Right on your sword. Go into wrath guard. You can turn all the way around. Back to wrath. Turn. Get that twist. Here. And turn. Feel it in your waist and in your arms, depending on how heavy your band is. back of your heel and lift your foot if you hit the ground. So you get in the center of your foot and don't lift your foot. Then track and turn. Really trying to get that twist. When I get that band up here, I'm trying to twist it all the way around. Feel it right in my abdomen and in my obliques. Again, still focusing on that breath. In. single. They don't tweak your back as much. There's a bolt here that pulling on the back. I can counterweight that and I can put it all in my shoulder. So let's go back to breathing. We're 
and breathe in. Or I can breathe in here. I like it in. uppercuts or if we want to put what I'm talking about is a twist so and we're still getting that big twist Do warrior two out of yoga, a yoga pose here. One, two, three, four, one more. Switch sides. One. Should have done probably about seven each side, and that would have evened it out. Okay, we're gonna do curl, Three, squat, press. Two, one, so here, curl to a squat and press. Back down. Curl, press. Curl, press. Curl. Okay, we're going to do our push-ups. In this case, we're going to do, try to get some breathing in there with them. And here, I'm going to breathe out when I, I'm going to breathe out when I go down, or breathe in when I go down. Breathe in. Breathe in. Side. on the breathing part again. Okay. Three, two, one. These ones here, Exercise 30. I'm going to call sword burpee. I'm not sure what else to call them. Thrusting, touching, back up. Thrusting, 
touching. Switch sides. Side needs a little more work. Quad is definitely a lot tighter. Okay, my hamstring. This one is just going to be a hold the sword out. Stretch my left quad. Watch the clock here. So I can switch sides. You can hold that. Pronation. You can hold that. Supination, whichever way you want. Switch back and forth. Okay, switch. Forgot about my breathing. Okay, let's get back to this. Here we go. section was to focus on that breathing in and out a little bit of holding of your breath on a few spots but getting that capacity all the way filled and all the way out all the way filled all the way out just so that you have the extra capacity in your lungs not the technique you're not going to do that when you know I'm not going to do anything special when I'm actually fighting but it gets your in and out used to that rhythm. So we don't breathe like this and real shallow. The more shallow we breathe, the less you're using your lungs. So that was the whole point of this series. So I hope you liked it. And if you did, please subscribe and I will catch you on the next one. See ya.